what K9 decides to go for. Wolf, huh? Okay. I think that out of all the spaces, Inkling does pretty well against Wolf only because Ink uh, Inkling is so slippery, so it's difficult for Wolf to really start the damage that he's looking for. But we'll have to see how K9 plays the matchup. That's just my personal opinion. And Charles is too. And so again, this is loser side. Both of these guys dropping into losers. I believe K9 to Nico 3 0 and uh, Exax to Habadango. Game three, five. Two. Yeah, game five. Already starting off with two big combos there, and gets a quick roller actually. Doesn't quite get the timing on the on the berry though. Yeah, this will be. I feel like this would be good for Exax only because uh, we still don't have re any really strong Inklings in SoCal, mm -hmm. and I don't think Cameron's had the opportunity to play that many. That wave line from the up throw at the top that was really clean. But the tech chase. That was even cleaner. <laughs> yeah, that was really, really sick for XX. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I got pretty shook when I saw that wave land. Yeah. I was like, whoa, what's yeah, he trying yeah. to do here? That's actually really clean for Inkling because they get so many up throw conversions on this stage. They just trap your landing from an up throw and then get a re-grab off the top. Really smooth stuff. Yeah. Oh, it, my goodness. This stage is so good for Inkling. For what this, you're seeing right now, these combos, so yeah. good. Already doing so great. Put himself at the ledge, and that <laughs> fair works on K9. Didn't quite work against Abadango, but it's, I mean, it's working. I can see yeah. why he likes to do it so much. Oh my goodness, the splat bomb just casually trapping his landing there. Really smooth stuff from Exact so far. Let's see how he tries to. Oh! <laughs> he's, that's how you know he's feeling himself. He's trying to yeah. smash in neutral. Really trying to feel confident right here. Oh. Less trap setup? Not quite. Yeah, it's uh, really hard to get around that down smash when you have the splat bomb forcing you off the ledge as well. Mm -hmm. So it makes Ailing's, uh ledge trapping games one of the best in the ultimate so far. Yeah. But. Can doing a pretty good job of eating this one up. Great down smash to cover the ledge jump forward there. How does he get Kane's back ledge. to the stage? Okay, yeah, just rolls right through the the neutral air. And no tech chase read from K9 either. He's gonna go for the back throw? No, up throw, no. I don't throw up at this percent. I yeah. thought he would try to go for an edge guard. Mm -hmm. Just because England can actually really bully uh, Wolf off stage if he wants to. Yeah. Oh my goodness, going for the crossover roll up smash. Yeah, I like that Exax is being safe, not trying to challenge those smash attacks from Wolf just because he can spot dodge cancel and do a lot of other stuff to get around it or throw out another smash attack. Yeah. Might not be enough. There we go. Get the back throw. What's the option going to be? Oh, my goodness. Just barely got the invinci or the ledge grab invincibility to get past the splat bomb. Yeah. You saw the little spark coming from K9 that he wanted to do the up smash, but Inkling just a little bit faster. Going to get around that just fine. Oh, yeah. The second stock is so close. There's Bolt looking for that straight hit to get the stock lead. No How's he get around this? The ledge. Ooh. Great oh, I thought, that was a, I thought that was a grab opportunity. Didn't quite take it, but there, there we go. go. Finally going to get it. K9's going to be very careful in this situation. He doesn't want to get in a position where he gets a free like throw combo from Inkling or jabbed up. Woo! He's so slippery. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Oh. Inkling is just such a fast character. You can get around those smash attacks uh, faster than other characters can. Exact playing safe, not trying to make it easy for K9 to get this stock off of him. He knows that K9's going to be looking for it. There's again, going for the up smash off the top. Free damage. More Air platform back extensions. Oh very goodness. nice stuff. K9 just, yeah, he has to play cat and mouse, and this is very difficult against a squid, actually. Just because they're so nice. fast. Another and another one. Yeah, yeah. Exact is all over him right now. Okay, yeah, there's not free, quite. <laughs> yeah, free up smash out of shield. Just showing how confident he is to just go for a raw roller in, in neutral like that mm -hmm. without any setup at all. I feel like if he gets a tech chase opportunity into a roller, he'll be able to take it. But look, so far, damage just a little bit too much. Up throw, up air. Is that enough? No, not on Battlefield. Still really good percent lead for Exax. He's still keeping him at the ledge of the stage. Okay, going to cover that. No, gets the fair string. Nice. Getting the platform assist as well. K9. In position to get some damage here at the ledge. Ooh, got to hold the shield there. Oh, uh, can I read in jump that time? Oh, not able to cover his lane with the down smash. Good job bringing this one back, though. Okay. Another back air. Oh, the splat bomb just bouncing him off the ledge, too. He's too far away, but no, gets the angled up uh, wolf flash. Barely mm -hmm. grabbed the ledge. Back throw? Down throw? Okay, down throw. Puts him on stage one more time. Just a shine on the splat bomb. Barely making it back to the ledge. Just needs... Oh, I was going to say he just needs one back air, but I guess not. Oh! oh! Back throw, maybe? I actually don't know what he'd go for. No. Okay, goes for the goes for the down throw again. Yeah, trying to retreat to the ledge safely, or retreat to the center stage safely with falling there, but it gets covered by the back air. Inkling like another character that can just play, or space really safe aerials. Mm -hmm. Even if they don't kill, they're uh, really hard to punish. 
Yeah. And eventually they'll kill like, you know, he saw like 200 plus percent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they just have to be safe. The inkling again, like you saw how long it took for him to actually get the kill. And it was starting to get into a nervous situation because K9 was getting trades and he put him in the 8%, which is prime position for Wolf to really get something. But he just kept himself safe, continued the ledge trap and just knew eventually, I will get this back air one way or another and I'm going to win that game. Mm. Moving on to Smashville, much smaller stage, less cat and mouse uh, to have to deal with. We'll see though. Xbox is moving really well. It looks really tricky for K9 to really get started on his offense. Mm -hmm. Nice, another free grab for Xbox. Another Nairs extension. Back there. So much percent, man. Yeah. Really solid to confirm that inkling has. Luckily for him though, he's not on battlefield, so he won't get as many extended combos as he did before. Mm -hmm. But right now, Xbox still in a really good place. Almost getting the down smash. You gotta watch it. That uh, that wolf flash at the ledge might be susceptible to that. But there's the berry and the turnaround F smash. Only taking forty percent. Yeah. Next, like even that carry that racks percent on you so fast that you, before you know it, you're already like at kill percent from losing neutral like two or three times. As Damn. we can see, exact going. Damn. To work, <laughs> man. Oh Beautiful. my gosh. Oh my quick zero to death from exact. I was making that quick was, work of that. That was insane. Did he catch the? Like Wolf Flash when you went into free fall with the spike, that was just really good. Yeah, it, because uh, Wolf Flash doesn't uh, sweet spot to ledge, so he just caught the right exact moment. Oh. Recovering back with Splatter Shot too. We yeah. might see another potential oh big combo here. I love how Exact is using the center platform to continue his combos, mm -hmm. getting so much damage. But there's a down smash. Yeah. Might have caught him ledge jumping or just ran out of invincibility at the ledge. Mm -hmm. Still though, uh, pretty rough for Kana. He's already on his last second, just getting all this percent racked up on him. Oh my goodness! Punches the F smash out with the roller. I'm surprised that didn't bury, actually. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah. Okay, here we go, though. I mean, 100% already on the K9, and Exax has another stock to work oh. with. This is especially where Inkling can definitely steamroll you because he doesn't have to worry too much about forcing out the kill. It's usually when it's in a lot, the same stock situation that he has to be a little bit more worried. Up throw up air? Uh, uh. No, no, I know it's still very close. It's a lot of percent for Exax. Another up air off the top. That'll do it, though. Only taking 40%. I don't even think he got touched, dude. Like, I don't think he got touched on that last lock at all. Yeah, that was, that was <laughs> rough. Exact one up two zero. I feel like K9, of course, always a emotional player, so you can kind of yeah. tell when he, visibly he's getting frustrated too. So hopefully he can try and keep himself together, keep him collected because. Uh, it looks like the x axis is the one that ha really has his head in the game, and yeah. K9 kind of getting kind of flustered. You can kind of see it in his body language, too, even before the game starting. The x axis is very collected right now. Yeah. Yeah, x axis is just, uh, I feel like he's familiar with Wolf, too. Like, there's a, he's a very common character, and uh, on the flip side, x axis is probably the best inkling we have in SoCal by mm -hmm. default now, and he just moved here not even like a month ago. Yeah. So <laughs> that should tell you how much uh, practice K9 really has against a strong inkling like yeah. this. But we'll see. I mean, he is a good player. He just has to get his head in the game, like you said. Really try to wrap his way around this matchup. Yeah. He's getting some decent amount of damage. K9 being pressing a little bit less buttons, trying to play a little bit more neutral air-to-air -air combat. And I like that the empty hop going to be able to start off a combo. Get the ledge trap situation going. But XX just fires oh right gosh, back. That up throw near back here. Reads the jump. XX is bread and butter for getting these really good percent leads. Mm -hmm. Okay, attacks back with the forward air into the wolf flash. That's really good for K9. Yes. Nice. Seeing him back off stage yet again. Oh, not going to get to the nair he's looking for, though. Still, yeah. that's probably the best edge guard he's gotten so far on XX. Mm -hmm. Definitely, uh, for once, he's actually got a decent lead, and it feels like K9 is actually nice. starting to control the pace for once on this match. Before, it was XX getting a big combo, and K9 just kind of had to get what he got. But now he's forcing his own uh, opportunities to win neutral and start extensions. Yes. And that's making Exax play a little bit less uh, composed here. Nice. Catching the uh, forward smash in neutral with the forward air. I'm surprised he wasn't able to get a lot, a lot more started off that falling fair, but still maintaining stage control, getting the hits he needs, and just working on his percent lead slowly but surely. Nice tech chase there, covering the tech rolling with the Epsil. Big damage here coming off from K9. Definitely the best he's played so far. Yeah, definitely. I mean, this is the first time he's had a stock lead, I think. Yeah. Oh. Really good spacing there, but there's the pickup of the up smash. Like, scooped him off the ground into the last hit. Mm -hmm. 
All right, let's see. Can't get, you can't get grabbed at low percent there because we already saw how much damage that could be able to get off of the up throw. Right. Nice. Catching the splatter shot from the ledge this time. Mm -hmm. you, saw he, you saw he ticked on a little bit of percent, so he did get the splatter shot damage, but not enough where it caused the hit stun. So right. that was great positioning from K9. Yeah, K9's definitely t turning it up this game. Double. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. He wanted to end it all. With yeah. that down air off stage, and I just, I don't, I don't know if I agree with that, man. Giving Xtrax a free opportunity to come back on you, especially when he's so good at racking up percent like this. Yeah, he already brought it back. Yeah, and, and he's now he's now has ready. the lead. Yeah. If yeah, he, he goes out if the tournament because of that mistake, that would be one of the worst feels ever. Yeah, well, worst ways to to lose your tournament set for sure. And yeah, Xtrax, I think he just saw that opportunity and he got the momentum going back again. Got the edge guard opportunity. Watch the splat bomb at the ledge. What's he going to go for? Oh. oh, the four smash doesn't okay. quite connect, though. Let's go for the back throw off stage, set up an edge guard. Goes too early for his nair off stage, not able to intercept the recovery. Oh, don't oh. watch the inkling dash. So, so tricky right here. Yeah. Oh, oh. He gets it so slick, actually, right there with the grab. And he got another uh, nair to put him off stage. And all of a sudden, a much more pressure situation for K9. Oh. Try to pressure the shield the up air. Holding center stage here now. Exact just dashes through him, goes for the throw. Now he has to deal with this splatter shot. Sorry, the splatter bomb at the ledge. Oh, the oh down smash, Max not range, quite. Down smash, not enough. Okay. Can I finally got control in the match at least one more time? Avoids the down tilt. How does oh. he get around here? Okay, nice grab. Back at the ledge again. What is Can I going to do to steal the stock? Though? That's where it's important. Oh, Woo! oh man. Dying <laughs> off of a trade. One more oh. opportunity for x -Axe. I think he just needs one good back air, and he'll be able to seal it out. And Can I recognizes that, Can being I? a little bit too much in shield. Can might be looking for the up tilt, too. Oh, my gosh. It's so tense for both players. There's the back throw. Yeah, not enough. Yeah, he finds a corner DI. He's just fine. Gonna have to come back to the stage one more time. No two frames coming oh, in. So scary. They are both have such fast moves they can use. But there's the dash attack catching the roll away. Just roll dash attack for K9. Game that game finally. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I, th I think K9 made that way harder than it had yeah, to be <laughs> for sure. I, that would have been so bad if he lost for just going for it. Him popping off too early for that down air. Yeah. He actually <laughs> almost lost the whole set for it. Yeah, that would have been such a heartbreaker. For but. All right, but I mean that was just for just that was just for K9 to put one on the board. Yeah, so. that was just to get one game. Like he had to play like, for his life just yeah. to get one game. Oh man, but I I just hope he doesn't do that again. That was so no. sick. that was way too much risk for a little reward there. For real. But he did turn it up the first two stocks. Like, mm -hmm. he looked firmly in his favor before he went crazy with that downer off stage. And now that they're just choosing to just go back to, for or sorry, Smashville over and over, I think K9 has a little bit of momentum. Yeah. I say that, though, but then x just does this. Yep. <laughs> huge, huge combos for x -Ax. I like the up throw Nair setups. Oh, wow. That was interesting. The roller looked like it crossed up. I think K9 kind of rolled there. So it might have accidentally ended up on the wrong side. Not able to find anything. Oh, oh that's so good. Deep. Nice, getting the Wolf Flash hitbox, he needs to stay alive, but dang, Exact's uh, sharking that jump off stage, he's got to be very careful. Almost yeah. gets the up smash to cover the anti-air. Yeah, doing these raw smash attacks, that's when you know Exact is really feeling comfortable again. I feel like when Inkling has a lead, then he can really steamroll that lead. But that's oh. the story for a lot of characters in this game, oh for sure. Oh my goodness. Really far off stage now, Exact's in a good spot. That was a, actually a risky Wolf, uh, wolf Fire up uh, angle, but actually it makes it back just fine. Canine's trying to find an opening to get started here. There's a dash action for the up air. Another up air. Okay, nice. Finds the grab. Oh, okay. not, not ready for the get up attack. Mm -hmm. Still, though, still staying alive here. He has quite a bit of rage, too, so he can definitely kill early if he gets an opportunity. But there's a splatter bomb seeing him really far off stage. Exact spacing really well on the ledge. Rolls all the way across the stage, though. Surprised he didn't back throw, actually. Oh. Uh, I think he might have just had the opportunity, didn't quite realize what side he was on. So you want to do it quickly and catch some bad DI. Yeah, you okay. can tell x is really just trying to, again, play safe yeah. just so that he doesn't have to risk a, a, a potential deficit against K9. Yeah. And he finally gets it with that back throw. Now, the back air at 0% doesn't actually come on the grab, but I keep seeing x go for it. Most of the time when people get hit by back air, they, eat, they instinctively want to go into shield anyway. Right. So that kind of just sets up into a grab anyway. But if you're really looking for it, then you can spot dodge, yeah. Mm -hmm. Back air jab seems more consistent, mm -hmm. actually. Yeah. It's a frame three, so it's pretty fast, so. Anyway, x still working with this stock lead here. Playing really safe. K9 needs to find this 
needs to find this kill before it gets too far out of his hands. Yeah. Oh, wow, the shield poke. Yeah, Forward air. Tech chase? No, not going to get the jab. Tries to go for the down smash, but gets hit by the get up attack. 181%. K9 just trying to find that one hit he needs to even up the stocks. But there's a tech chase down smash. He had just enough ink, too. Ooh. I thought he was going to run out before uh, the down smash came out. Okay. Finally getting the neutral air. Let's see if Kanan can get these low percent strings. Wolf is known for like down throw, dash attack, forward air grab. Yeah, we'll just have to see. There we go. Oh, oh the roller. There. He's going to get the charge up smash just slightly, and that's all it takes. Huge lead for Exax. Only took 8%. Now Kanan's on his last stock, tournament stock, that is. Mm hmm. Exax back to that big lead that he had before. I mean, the, the turn up that K9 had, I think he just couldn't quite find it again. And now Exax quickly adapting, gets that jab. That's yeah. just extra damage you can tack on. Yeah, just so taking, safe. Yeah, taking more percent when you're covering the ink, just really working out in Exax's favor. Huge, huge combos already. Catching him with the down air, too. Oh, safe down smash on shield, honestly. Yeah. Just trying to look for the neutral getup, but still worked out for him. Oh, oh man. There's the back throw. Set up the ledge trap yet again. Just charge up the ink a little bit. Back off stage again. Exact's calling it out. What he wants to get off the ledge with pretty much every time right now. Oh, my God. Wow. Almost landed directly <laughs> yeah. into it. He went up, so I thought he actually got hit by it for a second. Not quite, though. But still, Exact's playing with a big opportunity. Not able to find the Ken oh, combo. And there we go. Smash. Yeah. yeah. Catching that unsafe recovery from K9. He's going to go out of the tournament. 3-1. Exact's moving on.